thousands of Christians in Kenya today joined the rest of the world in marking the beginning of Easter holidays as Catholics mark the end of their 40 days Lent. Archbishop Philip Agnola from the Holy Family Basilica in Nairobi led the faithful in following the way of the cross around the city before joining Thicker Faithful where he called for political tolerance in the country. And as Emily Chabet reports, Good Friday is observed in somber fashion by Christians in remembrance of tribulations Jesus Christ went through before he was crucified. Good Friday for Christians mark the day when Jesus Christ died on the cross. And even though good and death may not always walk hand in hand, in Christian ideology, the crucifixion of Jesus Christ and the subsequent death on Friday represents the redemption of humanity. Catholic faithful across the country joined the rest of the world in marking the end of 40 days of prayer and fasting as Christians reflect on their Christianity and extending a hand to the less fortunate in the society. During whatever we fast is what we give because we share with the next person who has nothing to to eat or you know their life is less fortunate so for me it's a moment of realizing who am i as a christian we are reminded how jesus suffered and uh, how he died for us eh? so it's a good reminder we are supposed to remain loyal and uh, we are very committed to Christian. It reminds me what Jesus went through for me to be saved. So that's why I will join this uh, every year and also to reflect as a Christian uh, on where I have fallen short. Archbishop Philip Agnolo of Nairobi Catholic Diocese led faithful at the Holy Family Basilica in commemorating the day with a procession of the Way of the Cross around the city before joining other faithful in Thika, where he called for political tolerance in the country. Sisi kama wa Kenya, tuajali wenzetu kama ni ndugu na ndugu sababu mungu ametukumbusha kupitia kwa Yesu Christ ya kwamba yeye ndiyo muumba, yeye ndiyo muumba wetu sisi wote ni jamaa moja. Kwa hivyo siyasa tunawamba isiwa ya kwamba ndia na ya tutenganisha. Archbishop Anthony Muheria of Nyeri Catholic Archdiocese led the faithful in Nyeri in commemorating the important day for Christians around the world. This as the Anglicans at the All Saints Cathedral in Nairobi commemorated the beginning of Easter holiday in church. You don't have to do something wrong. The Bible is full of examples of people who did nothing wrong, yet they were wrong themselves. The story of Job is well known. The story of Joseph. And of course, Jesus, as we reflect about him today, is the greatest example. We need to do what is right when we have been wronged. Provost Dr. Sami Wainaina led the sermon that dwelt of peace and forgiveness. Emily Chabet, Citizen TV, Nairobi.